today, we're about to spill the tea. Ooh, this is really good. Now, I'm gonna put my tea aside because today we're gonna expose some truth. There has been things circling around the internet on how to get more likes and comments, but it all requires something called an engagement group. I feel like people are pushing on the subject of, you know, find people to come together and comment on each other's posts, but what I found is these people don't actually give a shit about what I have to say. It's just becoming a chat where people are forced to get social proof for a number on a screen. And I find like it defeats the purpose of social media, which is actually connecting with real people. Now it leads me to my point. How do you create real authentic engagement and start good conversations? So that's what today's video is all about. All you gotta do if you wanna know is keep on watching. Hey guys, I'm so... <gasps> I have a new hairdo, and I know if you guys don't give a shit about me, what's up, my name's Jade. So before I jump into today's video, I wanna just kind of announce something that I've been secretly keeping from you guys. So as you guys know, in the summer of this year, I was traveling to Europe for my meetup. Now, I'm traveling this winter to Asia, and I wanna meet you guys. Okay, so I'm announcing my Asia meetups. I'm kind of going on a little tour, you could say, and here are the dates. If you've always wanted to meet me, ask me a question on how to grow on social media, take a picture, this is for you, and come to these cities if you live by these areas, and all you gotta do if you wanna join is click the link below. It will take you to a link where you can RSVP, and I can't wait to meet you. And if you're not in Seoul, Jakarta, or Bali, please let me know if you have a friend that lives there, like, because I'm kind of nervous that no one will, like, show up but i do know that all i really care is meeting one of you guys and that will make my world so i'm gonna shut the fuck up and let you guys keep going with your day but i want to let you know that i'm going to asia let's go start this video and i'm gonna quickly tell you a story time of a tragic thing that happened when i was in an engagement group last year the reason why i'm telling you this is so you can really understand how to learn from my mistakes God, I fucked up, and how you can actually grow your account using these methods I've learned. So this story takes place right around last year. Now, an engagement group was where people came together to like and comment on each other's page to boost the post so you can get on the explore page and get more likes and comments. And to me, that sounded amazing. So what did I do? Last year, I joined my first engagement group. A hundred creators were in this Telegram group chat saying, new post, comment, it's great, but there was one important rule you can't break. In this chat, there was an admin. Let's name this admin Rebecca, AKA bitch face. Rebecca was someone who set rules to make sure the group chat was safe. It wasn't spammy, it was useful. So first rule was make sure to comment on each other's page and do not skip someone. It's every 24 hours and you do not miss a comment. Basically people are depending on you for their engagement. So I said, Rebecca, cool, I love it, I'm gonna join. First few days were awesome. I was getting so many comments. I went from like one comment on my page to 50 strangers saying nice pick bro. It was great, I kinda was digging it. But until one day, I decided to take a break. I was having a lot of homework and I decided to, you know, fuck this shit, I gotta work on my school. Um, and I remember Rebecca, AKA Bitchface, was like, what the fuck Jade, kick her out. And she started getting the entire group mad at me for not commenting. I thought an engagement group was a place where people would come together to care and read your message and see what you have to say. But it turns out it was just a group to get social proof and likes and followers. After knowing that, I left the group. But I realized I still need engagement. And this is where I'm at, where I've learned a way to actually get real people to give a shit about what you have to say without doing some bullshit method. Basically, the old method is just joining a chat and saying new post. I found the new method is all about caring. And this is why my method C-A-R-E. The first C represents content. The second represents add value. The third letter is R, which represents reduce spam. Lastly, E stands for engage by asking the right questions. So now that you know that, and you're asking yourself, hey Jade, what the fuck does that mean? I'm about to explain how the care method has literally gotten my comment section up to 500 comments. So first, content is key. You need to have the right content that's readable. Two questions you really need to ask yourself to make great content. What story am I telling and what impact do I have on people? I'm gonna be reiterating those two questions over and over again throughout my channel, so don't get bored because these are questions that you guys are skipping over. Storylines hold people's attention. Attention equals caring. So I hope you guys can understand that and make great content. Second, this is the most crucial part, add value. Something that I wanted to share was my 5.30 a.m. Dharma Nation group chat. I consider this group chat engagement group 2.0. The reason why is because there's one value we're adding to each other. This group chat is no longer a, hey, new post. It's, let's wake up at 5.30 together. If you want directions on how to join, just click the link below and I'll tell you guys how to join. But basically on my Instagram, I woke up one day and wanted to start a chat with a bunch of people who wake up early because that's a huge part of my life. And I was like saying, who? 
who else would do it with me? What I'm trying to say is be creative and fucking go beyond just new post. I think adding value is going to help people to care and really engage more. Third, this is a little hack I found which is called reduce spam by using your face. Now what I found, people like talking to people. There's a reason why you listen to Kylie Jenner more than Coca-Cola because Kylie Jenner is a person. Going back to that, I think texting is great. I think we run on text to text. But what about face to face? With Instagram group chats, you're able to add snaps of little pictures of things that you're going through, videos. And I just find that talking to someone's face is so much more fun. So what I found literally is our group chat on 5.30 a.m. Darmination has so much daily engagement. People are caring, they're commenting back, they're following each other because we're seeing each other's face in the chat. I think the biggest problem with the previous engagement group I've had was because no one really knew what I looked like. Like all they knew was my username. It was never Jade, it was at Jade Do you guys the difference it's like you, people just know you for your brand and not for yourself and they don't like to be honest it was really frustrating because i would try to like engage and try to sell stories but people are so focused on the number that i felt so empty what i found is if you don't have the right content telling a story and you're not really showing your face i mean i found that the engagement groups just become dry now the last thing i want to mention is something that you have to consider great conversations don't happen because people are commenting and snapping it's because people are asking the right questions. And I'm so thankful that I'm here like hosting it with you guys because I literally didn't come up with this idea. It was just so natural that I just wanted to share, which is the fact that if you're able to ask questions and you know, get people to help you and really add value to each other, that's when real conversations happen. The quality of the question matters so much. For example, instead of asking people to follow me back, like my photo, why don't you ask people, hey, what's your thoughts about this certain cause or problem? If you are in a gateway group and you really wanna do something about the current status of it, just go copy this link of this video and send it over to your chat and maybe, and I hope it will help you. Now that you know about how to make a care group chat, you probably need some members. Now it's super simple. Based on the value you're trying to give, you can add people to the group. Once you follow step one and two, all you gotta do is go to a hashtag with a similar interest. For example, if you're in Los Angeles and you're a blogger, go to hashtag LA blogger and start DMing these profiles. Hey, I give content about X, do you wanna join? If you are a LA blogger, what you can do is say, hey, I have a group chat of women doing networking, do you wanna join? Or if your value is, hey, I give product reviews, do you wanna join? Basically to add people into a group or to find users, all you gotta do is give them value and ask them if they want to join. Now this I know will take a lot of time and most of you are lazy as fuck, which is why <laughs> I basically wanted to give you guys a second option. If you wanna try the hashtags, let me know how it works and see if people can join your group chat. But if you wanna join the Dharma Nation and see what we have, all you gotta do is click the link below. Basically, something I've been working on is called the point system. Some of you guys might know, but I do have an app I've been working on to launch next year. And we're kind of testing out features to see what you guys like. And this is what we came up with. We're like rolling out this feature slowly, so be patient with us because I'm pretty sure uh, technology-wise, it's quite hard to build out. But we wanted to introduce it for the first time. Go click the link below to join a Dharma Nation group chat to see what group is the right one for you. I will literally give out, I will give out Darmination stickers. These have been sitting in my room for a while, so I'm gonna be mailing free stickers to you guys. Shout out to the commenter. Shout out to the commenter. Comment on this post to be featured in the next episode. If you wanna be the next comment winner, all you gotta do is comment, and I'll see you guys in the next one. I love you so much, and bye.